Hey guys, Panda here. This is Panda Girl Fashion. Um, there's like five of you that I'm talking to, but I hope there is more that joins my channel. If you're new to this channel and you're watching me, please subscribe. I have a lot of things coming up. I'm actually doing a lot of stuff. I'm doing um, box subs subscription boxes. I'm doing makeup. Me do trying to learn makeup. You're going to learn with me. Like, you're going to experience my life. And I have another channel called Panda Vapes. And it's almost at 300 subs, which is still little, but big for me. Starting all over again to a new channel because I just didn't think this content would go well with my subscribers on Panda Vapes. So I basically had to start all over. And it kind of, well, it really sucks because. <laughs> It looks like I'm new to this, and I'm not. I have a few. I've almost. I've like almost six months into this. So yeah. Um. So I'm climbing the ladder all over again, guys. All right. So I'm not sure. Um. So we're going to do some eyeshadow and kind of some contour contouring. Um. I saw some videos on that eyeshadow. I haven't looked at much videos on contouring. So I have the gist of it. I just need I need I don't know where to put what. You know, I have to like I so I will be looking at videos during this um YouTube um this chat the show, but I will try to either forward it or check it or take it out, you know, because I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> Seriously, and um, yeah, I just want to share some things I got. I got um the what is this called? Shade and Light from Pantman Cat Cat Van D. I Van D. I've been wanting this forever, and I finally got it. I'm really excited. I also um I got the chocolate bar, the original Too Faced, because I just love. I figured. If I'm going to start somewhere, I'll start from the original. And I just love this. I just love the original. And, of course, I'm going to eventually get more, get the other ones. I will have them all soon. I am a determined person. So, we have these. We're, we're going to be doing eyeshadow. We're going to be doing my makeup, basically. Um, right now, this is my skin. It's really red, blotchy. Eh. Also, Miss Flo is visiting me at the moment, so I have acne going on, and yeah, and uh, it's it's a mess. It's a mess. So yeah, mm -hmm. I have like I have dark under circles under my eyes. I it's just crazy. Ugh, I should have put my pluckers. You can see everything on here ah! <laughs> um so i want to show you a few things i did get recently um i i love shopping for makeup especially my fiance well fiance to be in like a few days i will have a ring on my finger yeah oh my god cut my cat is evil evil just for my cat so i got um this smashbox Photo finish minimize pores because I have so many pores and I have so many um, blemishes because of pimple acne and all that. So I definitely thought this will be perfect for me. The other primers are awesome. I usually never use autofocus, but I can't just keep like focusing in and out throughout the video. So just. It's going to be the death of me. <laughs> I, I don't have the patience for it. All the focus. So I also got this um, Sephora face, face tape or nail tape or whatever. It's, so I don't use um, scotch tape because I don't know how to do wings very well on my own. I, they end up big and like wow. <laughs> So this helps guide me, and I got I finally got some real safe hydrogen hybrid 
what is it? Hypoagenic, breathable, and easy to remove tape. So I so I stop pulling at my skin. Um, I also got a real beauty beauty blender. I guess you're supposed to wet these. It's because it says wet, squeeze, and bounce. So I'm pretty sure I'm supposed to wet this. This is my first real one. I got this one recently. This is like only a couple of days old, like a week old, but it only a couple uses. I haven't been really doing makeup lately because I haven't been feeling too well, you know. And I don't know. <laughs> I wet it because I see people wet them and I Walmart. I mean, whatever. It was to hold me off until I got my real one. So, I don't know what they're supposed to look like. I understand they get dirty. I'm not sure how to clean them. I, I have this spray from e.l.f. Probably not a very good spray because it's e.l.f. I don't know. I use, That was where I shopped for makeup was e.l.f. Because this is going to be a long video, by the way. So, please sit down. Grab some snacks. Um, get your coffee or your drinks or your whatever. And and watch the entire video please because it's gonna be fun <laughs> and if you haven't subscribed yet please subscribe to my video subscribe like at the end of the video if you like it like and share get me some subscribers so I'm not just talking to so, to five people because I know who them five people are well, I know who three of those people are and it's kind of like I'm talking to myself <laughs> okay so I got this beauty blender from elf okay so I got like basically this is my first new bait new nice beauty blender that is what I was trying to say this entire time and I just talk so damn much so get used to that all right so I'm, I'm gonna wet that when I'm ready to use it I didn't, I didn't get any, um, like I had elf cover up and I wasn't really like digging it that much and I haven't ordered any good cover up because I'm not, I want a matte finish because I have pores and I have oily skin, um, but I also have dry skin. I have a very mixed mixture of skin, so I didn't know, I just ordered a, I just um, bought a Walmart brand cosmet um cosmet um brand of matte stay matte um foundation just to hold me off if you know any better foundations that is good for um a mixture of dry and uh oily skin i've been doing co coconut oil treatments at night so my skin's feeling a little better it's not feeling so rough <laughs> so if you know a better cut um foundation please 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 leave it in the comment section and let me know hit me up with that um so what else did I get so I got some samples when I ordered from Sephora they had a gift kind of gift thing where I put a code on in and it gave me a gift so I have this um Urban Decay Lipstick and I actually made a video where I sh oh, I did an unboxing but I just never posted it so I suppose just do it here this is the swatch of it it's really pretty but it's definitely not one to wear if you're gonna be kissy kissying because it does come off and my my boyfriend would have red all over his lips. Um, but I think it's very cute for a sample. It gives you a such a nice bottle, like holder. Like it's just so cute. I love it. It's like something I would use when I was younger. Um, I got some Urban Decay mascara. Obviously a sample. I'm actually going to be trying this one out today. I don't have any fake lashes. I'm actually waiting for them in the mail. 
Um, so we're gonna have to deal with my damaged lashes. Because I literally like just used to just gank, I gank the mascara right off my eyes to remove the makeup. I know, like. <sighs> I know, I know. <laughs> I'm not supposed to do that, but I do. <laughs> All right, and I'm gonna stop. I'm gonna start not doing that because I'm noticing I'm missing eyelashes, a lot of them. All right, and we, the last and not least, um, out of the sample pack, we got the Urban Decay All Nighter. It's a makeup setting spray, long lasting. Now I have. When I have this uh, makeup, this was like it's like half full because it did spill out in shipping, which sucks. Mm. But um, yeah, I have one from Elf, and it kind of works. It's okay. I, I mean, I don't know. It's pretty okay. It's but this is hopefully gonna be better. It doesn't smell any better. They all smell gross, so <laughs> it's whatever. Ah, all right, and I definitely need a recommendation for a velvet or felt um eyeliner. I bought one for temporary use. I bought one from Walmart, and I accidentally got brown. And this thing is almost empty already. Like, I literally had to have it sit upside down for a couple days because I wasn't getting nothing out. I also thought this was a felt pencil, but because, but it was in the wrong spot at Walmart. And I try not to, like, I don't really get that many things at Walmart because they just don't work very well. But, like, it's one big pencil that whole that whole top is a pencil so I'm just like wondering what happens when it's like down in there because there is no sharpening nothing so yeah that is a crazy eyeliner I've never seen nothing like it so but let's see. it's actually really really like smooth it goes on really smooth to your skin so it doesn't like pull or anything like that. It's really nice. So that's a, that is a pro with this. All right. I also have, which I uh, I like the look of this pencil. This is obviously another Walmart brand. Um, let's see if I can get you focus in there. Um, I like the look of this pencil. It's nice and skinny and stuff. But, if you put it just a tad too long, you can't back, you can't back out either. You're stuck where you are. It breaks. Like, I lost so many just because it just broke. Yeah. Gotta be careful with this one. But, I do like it. I like it as long as you're very careful because it will break if like it hits a bump in your eye the whole the tip just falls off um all right so let's let like i only got like i only got this as a it's a liquid um a liquid sh blush and that's all i have for blushes like I don't know what kind of blushes are good so if you have any recommendations of any makeup at all like I don't from Sephora um or if you know a better web a web, better place to get make good makeup and it's cheaper please leave a link below because I am always open to new makeup and that is that is in my price range that's not crazy amount of money and that like I literally got one two 
Yeah, one, two. Oh, I also got this um cover this found this concealer. I got this, this, this. The gift was free, so I'm not gonna include that. This is not included in it. I got this, 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 and this for like a hundred and something dollars <laughs> seriously it was expensive yeah so if you know a place where i can get good makeup like like this if i i mean i don't mind spending the buck for these kind of things because they last a while but for for like concealers cover up foundations um beauty blenders um, primers, stuff like that, stuff that you're going to constantly run out of, and you're going to have to keep upgrading. Um, if you know a site that has good products and for a lower price, please leave a link below for me so I, because I, I, I'm, I can't keep going to Sephora. It's expensive, like honestly, it's really expensive. I need another, I need another option, <laughs> another option. I actually am joining up to a lot of beauty, um, a couple of beauty subscriptions, but I know there's, it's not, everything's not going to be for me, so some stuff I just need to buy, like, so if you know it, a cheaper site than Sephora, um, or if you know some way of getting, like, you know, Sephora stuff for cheaper, something, some kind of tips. Let me know, please, okay? All right, let's get started because this is gonna be a very long video. And yeah, all right, so I did wanna mention, I didn't know if I showed you guys, I got this um palette from Vanity Planet Essential 15 piece makeup brush set. I, 15 brushes, this is originally 99, And it's cruelty, they are, they're cruelty free. So I guess that's why they're synthetic brushes. I mean, bristles, because it's cruelty free. Um, Bronte, B-R-O-N-T-E. And you get 70% off your final price. So if you just get these brushes, oh, it's just for these brushes, I'm pretty sure. It might, it might be your final order price or just these brushes. I just got these brushes. So with that with the, that um, promo code, it gave it, to, it went from $100 to $30. And the shipping was like $41 or something like that. Super, super cheap. Like, I was like, oh my God, that is a steal and a half. I got it in brand and they are so, so nice. I will leave the name of, it's, it's probably like she probably gets some kind of commission for that I don't know um, I just know that that's what the, the code that I use and it worked so I'm passing it on I get nothing for um, for telling you about this code I'm not sponsored by anybody obviously I only have five subscribers so I'm definitely not sponsored by anybody but if there's anybody out there watching me and you want to sponsor a kind soul, I do have subscribers on another channel, Panavates. I do have almost 300 subscribers. So if you do want to, um, if you do want to sponsor me, just because I only have five on this channel, it does not mean I'm brand new. I am willing to get sponsorship and I will review it and give my honest opinion. And there you go. Yeah. So, okay. So, I'm going to be real quick about this because we need to get started. Because otherwise, you are going to get bored and run away from me. Okay. So, the bag is super, the case is super nice. It is like leather or pleather, whatever. It is all material consists of 62% PVC, 28 polyester, foam. 10% PU foam, 
and it is made in China. Okay, so you get all this. <laughs> oh god, you get all these brushes. Like, of course, I've been using them, so they're not as nice as when they came in. But yeah, you get all these. You get like down here. It this this one, this little dude, dude dad. Down here is for your lipstick. It's a lipstick brush. You pull it out and it, you know, let me show you. See it opens and then it's a lipstick brush. Or if you want to use it as like something else. I've already used it as a lipstick brush so it's already stiff. Because I'm really bad with lipstick. I have, small, I have a small upper lip so it's really hard for me to shape it. And you just get like, you get all kinds of brushes and they're super nice like they're not they're really stiff and but soft like they're very they're well they're well worth four dollars let me tell you I do need to get like how do you clean your brushes like do you just use hot water is there a certain spray that you get um how how is it that you clean your brushes because I know you're supposed to clean your brushes after each use because you start getting breakouts and stuff like that I'm pretty sure so let me know how you clean your brushes this one never wants to stay in its case I don't even know I think that's for like contouring so we'll see um let me know how you clean your brushes Oh, uh, so I can clean my brushes because they probably need a cleaning. I've used them about four times and I have not cleaned them yet. So, yeah. Mm. <laughs> Time for the cleaning. All right. Oh, and I also got this. I also got some um, face wash. So, coconut water. I love this stuff. So, all right. Let me go wet this like it says to do. And what's this? Like, I have no clue what I'm doing with makeup. So, this is so helpful to me. Come on, focus. Oh. And it also tells you how to clean it. I don't know what a beauty blender cleaner is, blender clean, cleanser, but I will be googling it. Oh my god! It does not want to stay in my hands. I will be googling it and buying one. Yes, I will be. Cause I, I am all about keeping my stuff clean. All right, I'll be right back. Let me go put this in some water and see what it tells me to do. Oh, I guess I should do my brails real quick. God, do not just judge me because of this. Oh, like I guess I'm going to keep reminding you guys that I am new to doing all this. So, my products I have are not the best, I know, and my eyebrows are horrible. I barely have any, so like I have like one little strand of hair that's like on them. My products are not the best. You do not have to keep. You do not have to remind me that my products suck. Please be nice and friendly. <laughs> and I know my eyebrows are both different. Okay. Right?
fix my eyebrows later guys I will fix my eyebrows later I promise all right let's get to the actual eye makeup which is using a light you might think because I hit the extra makeup off of my makeup brush that I know exactly what I'm about to be doing, you will be sadly and totally wrong. I've seen someone do it on YouTube, so I do it now. I have no clue what I'm about to be doing, so enjoy watching me make a fool of myself. Hope you're enjoying the video, and don't for forget to subscribe, like, and share. Subscribe just because you feel so darn bad that I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> Alright guys, back to the video. Or to the video, because I'm talking during the video. Because that's, I want to entertain you as you're watching me do clown makeup to my face. Bye guys. And as you guys know, I do, I am a vapor, so if you are like against any nicotine, which are this isn't even like it has like three milligrams of nicotine or like, like vapor or anything like that then you this channel is not for you because i will be vaping while i do my makeup getting off cigarettes is not easy guys and let me tell you, I've been off the actual stinky. My my cigarette tastes like uh, lemon and pie. <laughs> like I'd rather smoke to be vaping that than anything else.
smudging brush. This is the smudging brush. Like I hear like this instructions on YouTube and they all have like numbers and stuff. My brushes don't got no numbers. They got they're straight up like smudging brush, um, concealer brush, blah blah blah. So Alright, so I'm going to go to the white chocolate and I'm going to take it up here. Using my fingers never hurt me before, so I don't care. I need to spread this a little up. Okay. Alright, so now we're going to take the white chocolate, we're going to go in here and smudge like that, just pat it on, like so, just give it a base. <laughs> you see what I did there? Now, the same brush, I'm going to go into the marzipan. You don't want too much because you don't want the clump.
now. Like, honestly, like, what is she doing? What is she doing? I like it. I like it. Okay, it's gonna look so much fun. She's gonna have eyeliner and stuff on. And I can clean it up with, um, clean it up with, you know, stuff. Okay. Now we are done with that. With eyes. I mean, I did pretty well with my eyes. Um, obviously, they look crazy right now because this isn't the fiz fi finishing touch. I'm going to stop the video because it's very long right now. It's almost an hour and a half. And I'm going to start up a, a contour episode number two. And we're just going to do it like that. All right. I'll see you soon as we start episode two. I'll see you next time. Please um, subscribe, like, and share. I hope that um, you watch all the episodes so you see the finishing t the finishing working of what I'm doing because I know I probably look like a crazy lunatic right now because makeup never looks good halfway. Um, um, not when you're a beginner. Anyways. And again, I, I use in this video chocolate bar from Too Faced. This is not a sponsored video. I did pay for this on my own. $50 on my own. Yes, I did. $40 something, $49.99. Um, yeah, so Too Faced, if you want to give me like a coupon code or something, mm -hmm, I'm there. <laughs> so for, um, for my subscribers that I'm going to be building up because I know I'm going to be building up lots of subscribers. Alright guys, I am going to go and I will see you in episode 2 for contouring my face. Bye guys. I just want to keep you to myself.